Hi guys I am back with a new video. In this video we will learn how to hack any game using Game Guardian. Yeah, yeah, let's go. But first I am showing you my root access because Game Guardian required root access to hack game directly. You can see root access is not installed in this device. Taking a back seat, I'm passing anybody else who is rapping, I'm nasty. Ain't nobody able to catch me. They got So now I am opening Vifo no S to get root access. I got your girl and laughing and dancing. You can easily set up this app. Anyway, in this moment I am skipping it. So here I have already installed some apps from Play Store. But you can also import your apps from your device. Here it is. Click import and choose your apps or games which want to import from your device. Here I am importing Root Checker Classic. You can see it has been installed in by this device. Here it is. You can see that I can access root in this device. Anyway here is our game guardian. And here is our game. Click start on the right bottom corner. Open the game. Select the game. But before opening the Game Guardian make sure the Game Guardian data into your internal storage because it can be crashed for overloading. It checks data in the RAM but you should make it no. First we will hack coin value. Now you can see we have 105 coins so now I am searching 105 in the game guardian. The data type of coins, money etc are dword or int so select it. Now earn more coins and refine your value. Now you can see we have few addresses of coin value. So now I am back to the main menu. Now we will change the values and we will see which one is correct. Now you can see the first two values are showing awkward values so I don't need them. Now I am changing the third value. And you can see our value has been changed. Now I can change my amount as I want. Now I will hack car fuel.
I am saving the coin value first. Most of this type of values are counted in percentage so now I am setting the value greater than 50. Since my value is decreasing so I am searching for decreasing value. But I made a mistake somewhere. I am removing all values and I am checking again. Oh, I have forgotten to set the data value into float because speed, fuel etc. data values are float. Now do the same things. I think this is the correct value so now I am changing it rapidly. And you can see our fuel has increased. Anyway if you enjoy this video like share comment and subscribe to the channel to get more updates. Thank you for watching.